Hi, today we are going through our armchair travel section. We had some people tell us recently that a lot of our guides are very outdated. So we need to go through and get rid of any that are super old. And then because it makes sense to us, we want to have the foreign language section in with the armchair travel. So mm -hmm. we're thinking probably two or three of these shelves will be travel and then remaining ones will be languages. So oh. that'll be really cool. It could also be cool if we did like European and then had like the European languages. Oh, I love that. You know, like had yes. some like Europe. We'll kind of pull everything off the shelves, see what we've got inventory of. Yeah. And then how much space each mm -hmm. one will take. So. Here it is at a different angle, um, so you can see kind of everything we've got going on. Mm -hmm. For those of you who didn't know, English actually isn't my first language. Romanian was my first language, so I really have a passion for travel and learning new languages, and we really want to kind of make that apparent. While we organize the travel and language section of the shop, we want to talk with you about Babbel, one of the top language learning apps in the world. We both love Babbel because the lessons are designed by real people who teach foreign languages. Wie heißt du? Wie heißt du? Wie geht es Ihnen? Wie geht es Ihnen? Plus you get two free live classes included in your subscription, which are great for when you have questions or need help with your pronunciation. They also have a few different subscription plans, including a lifetime subscription, which is super cool. We think it's really important to learn languages the right way. We want to sound like native speakers, not as if we're just reciting phrases from a textbook. So many tourists from all over the world come into our bookshop and we want to feel confident in our ability to chat with them about a variety of topics. Babbel prepares you for real world conversations about business, travel, relationships, books, and more, which is why we chose to use them. Okay, I'm getting ready to take a break. Lass uns einen Snack essen? Ja, ich, ich mag Örnussbutter und Schokolade. Ah, cool, ich mag Bananen. Mm. Prost! Head to the link in our description box for 60% off of your subscription and let us know in the comments what language you want to learn. Alright, today is a very exciting day for us here at Spare Time Books. We're uh, going to be painting our new door. Yeah, We're on the same door. But yeah, but giving it a major facelift. So it's going to be so pretty. It's going to be the same green as the inside walls. And then you guys can see before and after. Let's go inside now. Yeah. Wow! Our sign is cute, so we'll be keeping this. This was a newer addition. Let's do it. We should even take this down. Yeah, yeah. We have nothing to apologize for. Now. No. Jake and I are finishing up at Target. His idea reigns supreme. As, as much as I as much as I hate to admit it, we're leaving with an empty cart, but we're going back to Home Depot and TJ Maxx or Home Goods. Yeah. So both. Okay. 
I got uh, this cat, and then tablecloths from here at Home Goods. I also got this really cute bag. I could not resist. So you take the same principle that we're doing with the tables, but you do it, you build a, and this wouldn't be that hard, you build a uh, shelf that has on the top of it, it's at an angle like this, and then you put tracks on the top. So it looks, in principle, it'll lay, the books will lay on the top like they would on the table, but they'll just be at an angle. And the wooden tracks keep the books from sliding. And so you can just, you know, keep putting it uh, books in those tracks. But this makes it, like you said, really easy, so easy for people to see like the books that we're looking for. You have to draw this out, right? And, and then understand at all what you're saying. tear down this one as well um, a lot of the stuff is on tables right now from around the shop for now um, so we're gonna keep going Carla and Jake once again kicked major bookshop butt while I was away. Um, they had some help from their friends, so that was cool. We're about to go in and see the changes that they made. Part of like the bigger shelves, but oh, I see. Yeah. yeah. Oh, how nice! Oh my gosh! Mitchell, 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 Mitchell! Very cool. <laughs> uh, I know. What do you think, Meadow? Meadow, what do you think? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Are you gonna do it? Yeah. Do you think you're gonna do it? Yeah. Do you think you're gonna do it? Yeah. Hi, editing Cleo here. I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching the video. We hope that you love the changes that we made to the shop just as much as Meadow did. We'll give you an updated tour very soon. We only have a few more adjustments to make to the shop until it's basically done, at least until we're able to save up enough for all new lighting and flooring, but that'll be in a little bit. We're at a pretty good place now where we're feeling a lot happier with the layout of the shop and the accessibility of the shop. We think it feels a lot more welcoming now and a lot less claustrophobic and we're really happy with the way it's been going. So we want to thank you all so much for watching and supporting us from afar. And if you happen to live locally and come into the shop, we're always happy to see you. And we are truly so grateful to our online and local community. It has been really amazing. And we've had the shop now for about five and a half months. And so much has changed since then. And we're really happy to have you along for the ride. And don't forget to check out Babbel with our 60% discount. 
and also remember to leave us a comment letting us know what language you want to learn and why. As established, we are both aspiring polyglots and are always happy to have conversations with people about languages. We'd also be interested to know what languages you already know, as well as some of your favorite words and phrases from whatever languages you know. All right, signing off for real this time. Thank you again so much. I'll see you again very soon. Auf Wiedersehen.